Hey guys, how's it going? I hope you're having a very good day. For today's video, I'm here to do a tag and this is the bookish related things that I own. And this tag was created by Jillian Raimondo. Definitely check her out and her video. I will leave a link in the description box below. So yeah, I'm here to show you things that are not books or bookmarks. Well, I guess I could show you bookmarks, but I don't have anything that cool as far as bookmarks are concerned. But anyway, these are things that are related to books or series that I've really enjoyed and I purchase merch and things related to it. So let's get started. I don't have as much as I thought I would have. I need to remedy that. Maybe around this season people will get me bookish related things. They stopped giving me books unless I requested them for Secret Santa, but for the most part my family doesn't want to give me any more books because I have too many. <laughs> Anyways, let's get started. I guess let's start off with the Harry Potter stuff. First of all, I got this Harry Potter shirt I got from Threadless and I don't have it on me because it's in the laundry, but I'll show a picture of it. And it's a really cool design. I love the illustration. We have Slytherin and Gryffindor kind of going head to head with each other while Ravenclaw and Hufflepuff are kind of just staying out of their way. So I have that t-shirt. Next guys, I have my Luna Lovegood glasses. You've seen it before on my computer. I got this from the Warner Brothers Harry Potter website. So I just ordered it from there and it's pretty darn cool. I love it. And the last Harry Potter thing I have is this Slytherin scarf. My sister and her fiance got this for me for Christmas and I love it so much. So we have the Slytherin crest right over here and I love it. So this is another scarf I would wear during the winter time, so that's pretty amazing. The next bookish related thing I have is this Keep Calm and Read On tote bag I got from The Strand when I went to New York for a week and of course I had to go to The Strand. Of course I had to pick up a tote. There are so many good ones. I want them all. This will be the first of many totes I will get from The Strand. So I thought this basic red Keep Calm and Read On tote would be perfect and I love it and it's so cute. And, mm, mm. <laughs> so that's one thing. I guess keeping on with the bags, I have this Ramona Flowers purse that goes with my Ramona Flowers cosplay when I've cosplayed her in the past. I saw this on Etsy and I wanted it and now I have it and I think it's super adorable with the Pink Star classic Ramona Flowers. Next guys, I have this super cute Clockwork Princess pendant necklace. I'll post up a picture so you get a closer look at the details, but it's pretty darn cute. This was from Etsy as well. I participated in this clockwork princess artwork contest Cassandra Clare was holding and I submitted my typography quote thing and she really liked it as well as other judges and so I placed in the contest and one of the prizes was this awesome clockwork princess jewelry. Pretty crazy how she created it with these little gears and stuff, but that's pretty amazing. Another bookish thing I have is this Band Books mug. This is another mug I really love, and it pretty much has all the titles of different band books that I have not read for the most part. I've read Catcher in the Rye, and <laughs> is that it? Oh, 1984. And that is all, I think, which is so sad. I love how the mug is black and you have all of these different colors just popping out at you. So I think this is pretty great. I also have these bookish magnets. You won't be able to see it, so I'll post a picture right up here. But anyway, these are different magnets with different bookish things. This one is bookworm and this one is knowledge is power. So I love these. I use it on my magnetic boards, one right behind me and one on my closet door. So. These are handy. Next guys, I'm gonna show you some posters. One being this Sherlock poster. When I went to an anime convention in my city, this awesome artist created some Sherlock fan art and I had to pick this one up. This is Benedict Cumberbatch as Sherlock, looking all cute and anime-y. And I don't know who the artist is. I should have got her card, but I love it. It's pretty amazing, so. We have Sherlock. Lastly, but certainly not least, I have this Fault in Our Stars poster signed by John Green at the bottom. Can you see it? Ansel and Shailene Woodley. Okay, let's see if we could see John Green's signature. Eh. Uh, where is it? 
Can you see it? Can you see it? Is it there? Alright. So John Green signed the Fulton or Stars poster, which is pretty cool. I got this poster. It was a perk after donating to the Indiegogo campaign they were doing for Project for Awesome. And it's pretty amazing. I don't know where to put it in my room because it's so freaking huge. I'll probably find a place for it. But yeah, those are all the bookish related things that I own. Anyways, guys, if you would like to do this tag, definitely feel free to do so. I tag everyone who wants to do it. If you have bookish things, do this tag. If you don't make videos, tell me what is your most prized bookish possession. Anyways, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. I will talk to you later and have a very good one. Bye.